Man, this is pretty warm out for uh, being February. Well, no, I think I probably took a vacation, but uh, never mind that. Hey everyone, uh, Tapper's here, and welcome back to hopefully the closing stretches of uh, Paper Mario the uh, Randomizer. So, it's been actually a couple months since I've last done any sort of recording, and I actually forgot those were metal blocks now. And, uh, last I remember, I do have... I don't need to go down this way. Because I can't do anything just yet. Um, but anyway. Uh, when we last left off... I didn't actually open that. Weird. Uh, last we left off, we, uh, took out Tubba Blava, even though technically he wasn't exactly in the wrong, but I guess... Oh, wait. We shouldn't have gone in this room. It'll be a trap, except it really isn't. So now we have only two dungeons left, and I got a feeling that was not the correct direction. Or maybe it was? Actually, no, maybe. So, um, anyway, where was I? Um, so basically it just comes down to... Uh, why has it been so long since I've last recorded? Well, um, health and just, I guess I've been more focused on a lot of, uh, outside activities in a way, except not fully, but it, I didn't mean to hit that, but it's okay. As long as I don't fall down the stairs, I'm okay. Actually, no, I'm gonna hit this just in case because I wanna say there was like a hidden treasure on top of the big chest that we're about to grab, but we'll find out in a moment. Uh, was it? Was it over here? Unless I was just thinking of tub. Oh, wait. Maybe it was... No, it was not. Anyway, let's grab this last chest, and we get the hammer. Yay! We can do more damage, and we can break those metal blocks. Which, I think now I can get the super boots, but... I'm trying to remember what was stuck where. Do I want to get... The treasures that were back here? Yeah, I may as well, because... There were some, uh... Bosses that... Oh, right. I forgot there's a badge. But, you're probably wondering, well, you're still technically uploading blindfolded Pokemon Stadium 2. I mean, I'm not gonna deny that, but it was just more the usual motivation issue that I tend to have. And what was that? Oh, it's a start piece. Uh, is this the one that goes after? Yeah, it is. Oh, I didn't know it could climb up. I thought it was only stuck down there. Eh, whatever. But anyway, uh, the stone chomps, uh, very defensive, except not really. I think I might have just did more damage than... Eh, whatever. Oh my god, they do 10 damage. That is insane. And, actually, I didn't even need to charge that. Woohoo! Four whole star pieces. Star. Star piece? Wait. Um. Oh, oh my god, I'm blanking. Star points. Wow. Um. Was there. No, wait. Maybe there was another one. No, okay. I, I I was trying to remember where the uh, second one was, but it's like the next two are like down this way. But anyway, uh, this temple is actually where you would get... Um, what is it? The... Uh, I forgot what it's called. No, that's not the way I want to go. Hi. <laughs> oh, right. 
Um, you have to pretty much go all over uh, the dry dry ruins and finding pieces like right here. We've got all three treasures. The um, no, that's the wrong one. The stones. Interesting that they have lunar stone, diamond, and star stone. I don't even remember. We're just going to bust our way through like we're an actual Tomb Raider. And there's the last block. May as well just finish up all, all of this and clearly do 100%. Except we're not because we haven't even seen Chuck Quizmo much lately. Ultra rank. I think that gives... What does that give Umbario? I don't even remember what his ability is. Oh, multi bonk. So... Mario's variant, except I think like the timing's a little weirder or something. Oh no, that block was a trap. It was a m stone mimic in disguise. But anyway, I was saying that like I've yes, I have technically recorded or streamed. Wow, they only did six damage. That's kind of pathetic. Ow. Well, Pokemon Stadium too, but I think it was just like a case of motivation of like what I wanted to do, and I think trying to sort out real world issues and stuff. I, the hope is that I'm like gonna get back into the swing of things just for uh, 2024, which were it's February 1st at the time of this recording, and. Hopefully I will not take forever to actually edit what I need to as far as it... God, I can't even open this thing. But, no, I want to go down here. Uh, there's a... Yeah, that's what I wanted. Was I able to climb out? No, I can't. I can only grab the leaf. And I'm not even going to bother with it because there's nothing of interest here. This place was always kind of like one of those tense places because, like, the best kind of healing items you would have, uh, wait, I want to go this way. Yeah. And now I should have, like, one key left. Yeah, that's right. Because straight ahead would be technically where we get the last jewel, and that tells us the answers that we need. Uh, triangle, diamond, lunar. Triangle. Or pyramid. Diamond. I'm going to leave this one alone because I don't want to activate just yet. And... In case you didn't grab the item for some re- I feel like I did a counter earlier, but eh, whatever. I'm just gonna grab the repel gel. Anyway. Long story short, um... Uh, does Bicelam do enough damage? Wow, I do four with that, but I do six with the... Oh. Uh, thanks, Merle. I could use that defense. It did 10. Or it did 7. I can't count. Or no, I, I can't numbers is what I should say. So anyway, I, I, was, always, I was saying that I do hopefully have some projects coming up. And like one that I would consider is the fact that... Uh, today, or maybe it was like a couple months ago, it was supposed to be like the 31st anniversary of Mega Man, and there hasn't really been anything of note that's resulted from it. Uh, don't mind Green Mario's Panic Dance, because uh, we're just gonna bring the whole temple down with us. 
And we're not really panicking anymore. Oh yeah, I... One thing I never noted until somebody brought this up was that... The weird kind of tense music playing right here... I don't know if it's like music of descent or whatever, but... Uh, oh yeah, and uh, some force is speaking spooky... Haiku, not haikus, not even riddles, but just warning messages. And we're about to see him here in a moment. Who do I want to have? Yeah, let's bring Watt. Watt's a safe bet, pretty much, any and every time. Oh god, this music's really loud. <laughs> oh no, it's a fair... Ooh, I actually like that blue and purple scheme. Uh... Because he, he usually is supposed to be, like, gold and green, I guess. Although, I think he's going to look pretty... Oh my god, it's undead Tetan Koopa. But, no, that's completely redundant. Common sense for running away. Faithful power. And... I don't know what it is about Tetan Koopa, but he's always kind of one of those bosses I kind of like. Because, just very strange. But also... Definitely the music. And he's supposed to be like some sort of... Magic Koopa Warlock in a way. And also a very dangerous uh, summoner because... Uh, he summons uh, Chain Chomps, which are... Um, very deadly. But fortunately we have ways of... Dealing with Chompies. Of course, typically you wouldn't have Watt obviously. Because this is like two chapters prior. And, hey, I actually dodged an attack. But, like, Toon Koopa can be very threatening if he's actually using his magic and not just chucking shells as if he's casting some weird spell. Magical genius! Be amazed! Now, he summons this chomp that smashes the ground, now, I the timing is always like really weird because the attacks don't come out at the same time, but it will always be like Mario getting hit first with Crumbling Rumble. Crumbling Rumble. Uh, not quite alliteration, I would say. Um, do I do? Oh, right, we have uh, Star Storm. <laughs> Good thing the Chomps have exactly seven HP. Otherwise, um, I'd be taking damage since Wad is still out of commission. But yeah, like, we're at the point where the boss isn't going to be a problem. And he hasn't even thrown all of his shells. It's like, once he does that, he pretty much has only got magic left. Okay, is that going to... Okay, good. One damage. Oh, please... Please, take yourself out. I guess it didn't happen. Huh. Weird. Uh. I'm really... S I'm so sorry, Scholar, but I kind of need your help right now. Um. Yeah, I, I don't have anything to say. Did I actually dodge some damage for what? I don't remember. No, I didn't. Okay. I'll bite the bull on this one because I want to see him take himself out, which would be hilarious. I still did 10. I'm going to win by doing absolutely nothing. Come on. Okay, he's not doing it. Eh, screw it. I'm not going to waste any more time because what he's supposed to do is the spell's supposed to backfire and yet for some reason he... it never did. And if he, if he gets hit by the crumbling rumble, 
he would fall off the platform and be susceptible to uh, the super hammer, which would be usually a better attacking move, but since, I mean, you don't get the super boots until after this chapter, but, yeah, whatever, it doesn't really matter. Um, oh, that, that's Miss Mara, I think, I, I, or, is that her name? I already forgot. But yeah, she was, she would give us a lullaby after we collect her, but it, it doesn't matter. We got six uh, star spirits already, and uh, fun fact, I actually forgot to save um, when I ended the last uh, video. So I had to redo the Koopa Coots, and that was pretty much it. Dry Dry Ruins, uh, free second. Marmar, okay. Mamar. Like, I don't know if she's supposed to be the mom, because I always considered it uh, Miss Mar, if I even have that name right. Return to Store Haven. She has a bigger smile than I remembered her having, because... Uh, go six. Oh, she's going to give time out. Okay. Time out. Uh, stops all enemies track. Which is very useful for the, um, not the clefts, but the club, the clubas, that's right. Since they're usually the ones that nap pretty much wherever. But, anyway. So we got six star spirits, and did... Okay, we already healed. Ooh, we got pink bar. Because it, it goes until... Is it an orange bar last? I don't know. So, we have... I still haven't gotten the statue. Um, the frying pan... The keys... I wonder if that means I can actually go to... Um... What's it called? The, um... Maybe I can get to the end of... The Crystal Palace, but I'm honestly not sure because I think I just needed the the red key. Unless I'm key items. Bowser's Castle, big red key. Yeah, I think maybe I have everything except I just didn't get some of the key. Oh, actually, we need to do Koopa Koot stuff. And I have a feeling I need to kind of remember one of the tasks. How can we do a task? Very generous generation. Um, get a package from him. Uh, Goompa, Bootler, and I were traveling at Boo and looking for us friends. Oh, is this the one where I have to see all the older... Or no, maybe I'm thinking of someone else. Um... Uh, he's struggling to ask nicely. So I think it was... Gusty Gulch? Is that what it said? Yeah, I forgot. Okay, let's see if I remember where everything was. It's been so long that I kind of... Oh yeah, this is right. Basically, once we get the last Star Spirit, I think this is kind of where the game just ends up being... You're just about done, now just do Bowser's Castle, however long you have it for. That uh, looks good as usual. Oh, okay, I do turn. Wait, wait, it's not you? Okay. Oh, okay, it's the second one. I'm not sure why. Should I, uh... Kill some time. I think I just go off screen and then come back. Or is this the one where I have to, like, go three screens and then he gets it? Nope, he found it. Okay, heart moat. Wasn't expecting that. I was hoping there was more flavor text, but I 
guess there wasn't. But I imagine it's something like... Koopa Koot's version of giving him an errand that you would have the tape from... Uh... Goomp Goompa, that's who it was. There was a tape talking about the shells, and then... There's a lot of memorabilia, and I, I kind of didn't even remember that part of this game. Then again, this is, I think, the last set of uh, tasks, so we're pretty much in the home stretch. Take your package. Uh, livid lava prawns. Okay, yeah, don't remind us of the lava prawn. It's kind of meh. Uh, but then what's inside? After you leave, damn it. I feel like you owe us, but eh, maybe not. Okay, what's something called a coconut? Um Oh crap. Do I have a coconut? I don't Oh, Colorado. I didn't actually realize you were home stay for change. So you'll show me. Uh, oh yeah, this is where he's talking about. Uh, actually, I just realized I can't uh, get him to move from that one place because I still haven't found that one um, idol piece thing, which hopefully is in the uh, crystal pal. I do have a coconut. Yes, let's go. I didn't think I held on to one, but maybe it was because I was going to make the dynamite recipe, but honestly, I don't really see a point in it. Not in randomizer. Crawling clefts. Um, I think he'll give... No, this must be the last one. This he'll give me something random. Uh, get one of those red jars uh, from the ancient kingdom. Oh, yeah, the certain order. First you buy Dusty Hammer. Dusty Hammer, Dry Pasta, Dusty Hammer, and then... Dusty Hammer, Dry Pasta, Dusty Hammer. I think there's a way to, like, get the information, and I assume it's from... Uh, was there someone hiding here? No. Okay, wait, how many items do I have? Eight. Okay, yeah, I can't actually do this part because I have to have enough items in order to do it. This one I might just look up because I th thought I knew, and there's supposed to be like a- I think you may have to do it like, randomly. Hmm. Okay, let's get rid of the snowman doll. Let's... Oh, no way, I can store some items. Uh... Actually, I can only store one. Seventeen. Well, actually, I could use an item and then, Okay, so it was a... Dusty Hammer... Maybe it's a Dry Shroom? I'm gonna actually look this up real quick. Oh, that's right, I forgot. I put my phone on the charger. Um... Paper Mario, Red Jar... I may cut if this takes a bit. Okay, I was exactly right. It is Dried Shroom at the end, so... We will get... Dusty Hammer. Dried pasta. D 
Dusty Hammer again. We will... Nope, that's not it. Eat dried pasta, which is not going to taste good. Well, actually, it's better than a dried shroom. Now we'll do that. And we will get the... Is it your sign? Ancient Will. I don't remember the last time I've done this. A red jar. Oh, it was an antique. Or collector's item, I guess. Does he say... Okay, he doesn't say anything else. I thought maybe it was like the red jar was supposed to be something like Legend of Zelda E, where... Um... What was it? It was supposed to have like some sort of life potion or something. But maybe I'm just like over not over dramatizing it. It's more like I'm giving it a lot more. It's more important, or not as important as I thought it would have been. But anyway, red jar, levitating lactose, and that's gonna be the last. It's a little filthy. Well, why did you want it then? Oh, actually, no, wait. You have a blue and a yellow jar, so... Red, blue, and yellow. Nice. And we got the pretty lucky badge. Okay. That's not what I expected. Um... Did he not have any more tasks? Weird. I could have sworn he did, but... Yeah, whatever. But anyway, so we may or may not be done with Koopa Koot's task, because I wanted to say that this was the last one, and he didn't really suggest anything at all. But anyway, we're now down to probably the last area, and I don't think there's going to be anything Uh, you know what, I'll just grab this so it's out of here. Nah, I'm not gonna grab that. Oh, I see Quizmo. I need to sharpen my memory. Or my knowledge, I should say. Oh, speaking of knowledge, there is one game show I've like been watching lately, The Floor. And it's kinda like one of those uh what's the name of the fellow said? No, uh, that's Rolf. But it's like it's a pretty fascinating game show where you have uh 81 people, at least I think it's 81, with like a different topic each. Oh, he's only got the one question. And you have pe you get the randomizer that chooses somebody to start the challenging process, and then you get a bunch of images, and you just kind of like... You flash through them, and then you just see who outlasts the other, kind of like a duel. And pretty good knowledge, I would say. Wait, is this the right way? I have a feeling this is not it. Oh, God, it's lagging so hard. No, this is the wrong way. Uh, oh no, wait, I have to go to the blue house. <laughs> I'm wasting so much time. Let's not go to this lag gener generator anymore. Actually, there's also the... There's the karate dojo that I haven't done, but... That probably does not yield anything. At least, I'm pretty sure. So anyway, uh, what I was mentioning before is uh, other projects that I would consider doing, and like, I, I mentioned Mega Man being one of them, and honestly the X series is something that I've never really talked about en enough, or at least not for a good long while. Particularly the latter half of the series. And a few of them I have not played in a very long time. While the other... I've at least sort of gone into some lengths. Well, actually, I only really played 1, 2, and part of 3. Well, not exactly finishing it. Uh, was there... Oh, right. I haven't finished the dungeon, so... Of course he would be there, still. 
Eh, I'll take the maple syrup since it's there. Um, I think when... Uh, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna st stop the recording here, and uh, next part, I will be at the Crystal Palace, and then we will continue from where we left off. Um, or at least where the, fir the first I've gotten, because I actually don't remember if I just needed the red key or not, but we'll find out. So, um... I'll see you in a bit. You know, I never realized how funky this track was, and actually it's not too bad. It kinda reminds me of... Bomberman? I, I don't know why. Even though it's not... Ice Mountain, or Blue Mountain, or whatever it's called. 